Clara the cow worked for herself. She sold her own milk from a freestanding shelf. She made tiny cartons for gerbils and rats and sold it in dishes to hundreds of cats. Business was good. Her aim was to please. She even began a sideline in cheese. She extended her stall and hired a sales team. Daisy sold butter and Maisie sold cream. Now, just down the lane lived a chicken called Gwen, who worked on a farm from nine until ten. She'd laid eggs at the farm from the day she was born and passed Clara's stall each morning at dawn. That looks the life, thought Gwen to herself. I'll be like the cow and set up my own shelf. So that's just what she did, not far down the lane, selling her eggs for beakers of grain. That hen can't do that mooed Clara the cow. It was my idea. I showed her how. But the other creatures just didn't agree. They all bought Gwen's eggs and paid a good fee. For Gwen's white eggs were the best in town. And by special request, she also laid brown. She ran special offers and other sales tricks. You get a free egg cup if you buy more than six. Free gifts, mooed Clara. That's a last straw. She's gone too far. This means war. Gwen didn't know that Clara saw red. Till a carton of milk sloshed over her head. It was closely followed by a block of cheese that bounced off Gwen's head. She fell to her knees. Gwen called back. So that's your game. Then picked up some eggs and took careful aim. Soon eggs and milk flew through the air. And everyone hid from the warring pair. The two of them splashed and fought through the mess. Which one would win? No one could guess. You couldn't see much but feathers and legs slipping on butter and spilt milk and eggs. At last, they both stopped. They could battle no more. Then Gwen started laughing at the mess on the floor. She offered Clara a wing and said with a handshake, Congratulations, we've made the world's biggest pancake. Well, Clara looked round and saw it was true. The world's biggest pancake. <laughs> then. Clara laughed too. It had even been cooked by the hot midday sun, and a line of the hungry had already begun. The cow said she was sorry, so Gwen forgave Clara. And now they are partners in a new pancake parlor. Which just goes to show that from a big goopy mess can come the ingredients for unbridled success.